Welcome back to Coding Commanders. I'm Commander Candy, and today I'm going to show you how to install and set up Postgres database on Ubuntu. Today I'm going to be using my laptop, which has Ubuntu desktop as the operating system, and I'm going to SSH into another computer's virtual box image with Ubuntu server on it. Now, if you currently don't have access to any kind of Linux or Ubuntu, but you want to learn it or try it out, I do have tutorials, both YouTube videos as well as written lessons on commanders.com on setting up Oracle Virtual Box with Ubuntu. I'll link those in the video description. So the first thing I'm going to do is an update, sudo apt-get update. Can ask you for your password, type it in. And next, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to install Postgres. You will find all the commands that we'll be using today written out on my website, codingcommanders.com. The direct link to those lessons is in the video description. Now I'm going to install Postgres by typing sudo apt get install and then the name of the package, which you will find written out on my website for the corresponding lesson. Now I'm going to switch to the Postgres Linux user by typing sudo -i -u Postgres. Now what I'm going to do is add another user by the name of Candy to match my Linux username. I'm going to type create user dash dash interactive. It's going to ask me for a role name, Candy. Yes, I'm a super user. I want those special privileges so I can operate the um, database through this account. If I'm using an application, I might want to log in through this account, probably not the Postgres user account. Next, I'm going to create a database also named Candy by typing create DB Candy. Then I'm going to type PSQL to get to the command line. Once you're on the command line, you can type backslash L to list all the databases. Now I want to go ahead and give Candy a password. So I'm going to type alter user Candy with password and I'm going to put Candy in quotes. I'm using the password Candy, but you probably want to come up with something a little bit more inventive than that or random. <laughs> I'm going to do backslash Q to get out of PSQL to the regular Linux command line. And I'm going to type SU space candy to switch back to my candy username. I want to get out of Postgres. I don't really want to hang out there. Now that I'm back at candy, um, I'm just going to CD back to my home directory. Now I'm going to type PSQL space candy and I'm going to access that PSQL command line right into that candy database. If I wanted after the database name, I could also specify what user I want to log in as, but I did not do that. Thank you for watching my video. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to comment below so I can help you out. Also, don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications so you can take advantage of my free computer programming tutorials. Check out my t-shirt shop and follow me on Twitter because I'm really funny. Also, this is the first video I ever made wearing absolutely no makeup. I've been really busy doing the software engineer thing and it'll be a lot easier for me to produce videos if I don't bother with hair and makeup so much. So let me know if you liked it. Thank you again for watching and until next time, happy coding.